by myself just need to press the record button and then everything will be okay hi guys this is peter letts and for my next let's play i'm going to be doing something people probably don't really care about that much it's a sports game called nhl hits 2003 uh, i know a lot of people out there don't give a fuck about sports and to be honest i used to not so much anymore uh but this is hockey probably the least popular sport out of the most popular sports however in Canada it is very big and I'm not sure if people understand just how big hockey is I didn't before I was here uh, that was a odd thing I mean of course you know when they, they they tell people that it's more different than you think and of course that's the exactly the case in just about everything Little stuff like that, like for example, hockey. Like you know, I'm not used to having hockey on the local news, even where I'm from, where the hockey's pretty big, but not too big, I guess. Uh, if I sound a little bit tired, it's because it's the it's the early morning and it's my day off, and I decided that um, all my neighbors in the apartment usually make a ton of noise before a certain time of the day, and if I want to get recording in without banging and pounding and all that sort of ruckus, I had to do it really quick. Otherwise, it won't be a good. Let's play. You know, living in living in Canada isn't that. I don't know. I think it's really kind of funny how people always say like the second, "Oh no, I disagree with something politically." I'm moving to Canada, and I don't know if that's just something in the Midwest, but it's all. I'm guessing on the West Coast too. I'm guessing pretty much anywhere that's close to the Canadian border. I'm guessing. And that's why I think a lot of people think I'm one of those types, you know what I mean? Like, what... Everyone I work with, for example, I think, just kind of knows I'm American. I think they all secretly ask themselves, why is he here? And stuff like that. They don't even bother to learn my name. Everyone thinks I'm named Steven. It's bizarre. Like, like independent occasions, too. Like, there's no way that people could have conspired to do this kind of stuff. Like, I've been called Steven. And they, you know, everyone, for the, like, when they say Canadians are nice, yeah, it's true, yeah. They're not outward jerks. But people weren't outward jerks where I'm from, too. I can tell you they weren't, you know. All that meant was that no one said anything. It's the old fucking phrase, like, if your character says anything nice, don't say anything at all. I mean, that's, that makes for a lot of quiet people. And my work permit expires pretty soon. Oh no, I might have to go take some classes. I've been talking to a few people, they give me a few options and stuff. I'm not even sure. I'm not even... I don't like thinking about it. So I don't. But it's sort of weird how, like, you know... I mean, Winnipeg's a nice city and stuff like that, but... That's another tired expression. Is it home yet? I don't know. It's where I live. But, you know, I don't know if it's just how, like, a feeling I have, but, like, I, I just think that everyone kind of knows I'm an outsider somehow. Or maybe it's just the way. I'm not sure. I don't know if I can learn French. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. I gotta. <laughs> I gotta do it. You know what I mean? I mean, it's probably... I mean, there's tons of shit going on right now. Immigration is, like... Dealing with way more important things than some pissant, some pissant kid. You know what I mean? I think if I, if I was a kid, it'd be easier. But I don't think people understand just how different it is. Can we think about that for a second? Like, I get it. You're upset. I get it. You know, you want to just give up and stuff like that. But people in my in like my apartment, I don't know. I think, and I definitely know people at work don't even bother. But like people at people at work just kind of like. I've had someone that was like, ask me before, like, why are you here? And by the way, like, people don't say A the way people think they do. It's stupid. It's weird. I don't know. They think that, like, the, the way most Americans use the word A in reference to Canadian is just wrong. I don't know how to explain it, though. 
I just know it's wrong. But I think people can tell that I'm different somehow. And I don't. I don't even know how. I don't. I don't even know how that is different. But like today, I'm out for a smoke, and like I know that it's gonna be very noisy in the apartment because a couple people are moving in, and like this guy comes talks to me and says, "You're an American, aren't you?" And I was like, okay, "Great." Not only do I have to talk to somebody, but someone knows more about me than I care for him to know. And I, you know, started making a small talk to him. That guy's actually pretty nice. He, he, he says that, like, his, like, girlfriend and fiancé is American or something like that. And, uh, that's, you know, I guess that's how he knows or something. I don't know. Maybe he has some kind of weird supernatural ability to detect the nationality of people to whom he talks. He told me his name. <laughs> And I, I can't remember it now. It's weird. It starts with like a... I think it starts with an F. I want, like, I want to say it's like Francois, but I know it's not Francois. I have no idea. It's weird. I've never heard a name like it before. That doesn't happen very often. Like, oh, the name seems so familiar and yet so different. Is Winnipeg home? Does it have to be?